Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Hortak and we are playing Europe Universalis 4 with the newest DLC, Golden Century. Welcome back to our Venice campaign. We are in a war, one against the Papal State and two against Spain, Portugal, um, Bomanis. The only action is going to be to siege down my, my trade thing down here, which is going to hurt in terms of income, but oh well. <laughs> oh well. They can't really do much. This is a war that mainly goes after Spain and no one else. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. One, two. This is a tough fight. We've got to see if we can actually save this. Pope is kicking our ass. I mean, they have a really good general in this. Okay, we captured a ship, transport ship. Uh, that we don't really need, but we'll take it nonetheless. What we no longer need here is the blockading. So I guess we send the fleet over here. Oh man, that was so close. That's so close. Yeah. Almost didn't make it. Send these guys out to Milan. We only need 36,000 men to get that. Rosetta wants a seat in the Great Council. Yeah, sure. I think that's fine. Alexandria already has one. No, it doesn't actually. Still, that, that's fair. I want a seat in the Council. I have a fair amount of development. And I don't want to lose all that development in there. Spain has more development than we do now. I mean, they mainly stole it from from like Africa and the Indians. Nice thing is that a bunch of my vassals actually have pretty competent fleets here. I approve. This is nice. Okay, I've got another transport ship that I don't need. So now we have 40. I want the Suez Canal. As soon as we can do it, I'll try to go for it. Suez Canal would be dope. These ships aren't looking too hot. This does reduce, uh, uh, increase the ship build repair, so I guess. Only speed two. Kind of like to do that when I'm fighting a war. Can't do it in multiplayer though, so. Are these guys gonna go for another attack? Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> this is so annoying. Yeah, I can't get out of this anymore. Alright then, because we gotta go into this, spare no effort to help the, the colony. Oh man, our morale is just too bad. That general is just wiping the floor with us. I mean, he's also rolling 8s and 9s, which is certainly no help. That's Florence coming along to save the day. We just narrowly won this. What the heck? There's so many troops in this one. So listen, um, Florence, you're gonna siege this one down. This one is gonna go to Caraman. This one goes to Byzantium.
<sighs> this is tough. And we can't stack wipe them because we have no way of going in there. We can destroy the fleet, but basically down now in terms of manpower. That is tough, man. Why get completely kicked in the butt by the Pope? Yeah, it's just that super good general that they have that is the problem, I think. That general changes everything. We don't have a three-star general. We could try to roll for one. Hmm. Don't think he's good enough. I mean, it's not horrible, but uh, the other thing that we could do is slack and recruiting standards to at least get some manpower back. Still, that's pretty rough. That costs a lot of manpower. Okay, we're gonna fight the Pope here. That's the Papal Fleet. We lost the galley, but gained two trade ships. Okay, we're fighting against these United Spanish and Floridian fleet. Yeah, we lost that siege. That was very clear that that would happen. <laughs> okay, we have a famine. Not much I can do there. But like mainland Spain is done. Mainland Spain is just totally done for. We really have to give the coast to Florence, first and foremost. I don't mind the Pope actually having, like, Rome, but the rest of Italy is mine. Mine or my vassals. West Timor is not producing tea. That's fine, I guess. interested in going into this battle and why wouldn't they like they probably need to press their advantage now well, we have a war breach now committed. Send our troops in. This might allow us to stack weapon, maybe. Nope, not quite. Where's Caraman? It's only Florence now that's doing the sieging. I'm not sure why Naples isn't involved in this. That's weird. Oh, we actually have a Spanish army over here. Well, we gotta we gotta confront them here. Don't think they can do much at this point. They still only have military tech twenty. They have good ideas, but two v one probably not something that they can do. At least not easily. Yeah, man, this is such a stack wipeable army. Tell you what, we gotta chuck all our cannons in. Give this the maximum siege bonus. Maybe that'll do it. What do I want to do? I wanted to do something. Yeah, well, we'll take the... Oh, no, we can't do this because we're at war with the Papal State show. We'll do it afterwards. This is fine. Okay, so now with the cannons, this war should go much faster. 
Oh yeah, I've been thinking about taking Parma, so do we really want to do it? Like, if they have no allies. Yeah, I don't see why we wouldn't. Peace offer from Manipur. Where's Manipur? Where the hell is Manipur? Oh, Spain has this, really? Patna. Manipur. Oh, really? That's taken by me. Oh, did Ayutthaya do this? Probably. <laughs> um, had with Spain. I'm gonna stop your alliance with Spain and you know, war reparations. And give me a trade power. Oh no. Spain is taking these provinces. Oh man, that is gonna piss me off. I don't have don't have any defenses on these on these islands. They're probably gonna take these provinces. They're gonna probably steal them from me. They can do that. Damn it. From the Siege of Cuneo. Ah, that's that's good, but Take the Republican tradition here. We might have to boost our stability, I guess. Um, yeah, we'll have to run to help Naples. Run, 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 run. Okay, we killed the Spanish army. That's good. That's real good. Hmm. Yeah. We need a an army that has about 20k. Ten to eight. That's probably fine. Uh, we need a general on it. And uh, yeah, we need to we need to stop them from taking East uh, and West Timor. So I'll just come over here, park the ships. I don't think they have a fleet in the area that is strong enough to stop our guys. They burned our colony, you bloody bastards! Okay, I was kind of I was kind of mild against Spain, but this really rattles me. You bloody bastards. They're just killing our province. That's not right. Oh, well, when I get to you, Spain. I promise you that. Burned our colony. Our people cry out for vengeance. You betcha. These guys are gonna die. Couldn't burn the other stuff, but I thought they could do this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is happening. Where's my fleet? Run, 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 guys. Come on. Chop, chop, chop. Oh man. <laughs> they destroyed my calumnies, the bloody bastards. I mean I gotta send I'm gonna send new colonists right away. And I will destroy that army that is on here. Make no 
no doubt. Make no mistake, we're gonna get there. Are you tire operating over here? It's actually pretty useful. So how are we looking now? How's the papal state looking? Okay, we get some esprit de corps. Uh, can almost push that into some additional manpower. So let me just do these things. So we'll flip that to Naples. We'll flip this to Naples. 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 Yeah, we should also try to take Malta from them, I think. We do have the ships to do it. Might as well. This is all right. I mean, could we maybe, as a retribution, burn some some Spanish provinces? Is that something that we can do? Like this is just a port, so. Influential trader, sure. Gulf of Arden, that's fine. Okay, the army's been destroyed. Let's take back Flores. What do we do with the Papal State? That's the question. Like, we've basically fought them down with 99% war score. Florence. 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 Oh no, we actually, they still have lands over here that we could go for, I guess. We would have to land in Corsica. That might not be a bad idea to actually do that, because there's also a Spanish island on here. That could stop a bunch of nuisance. Yeah, we'll, we'll use that fleet to just land on, on Corsica. Why not? Go for a little bit of a naval maneuver. So the Pope wants out. Sure, Pope, sure. Let's see what we can do. I'm not interested in getting Wallace. I think I'm gonna force him to give that back to, to Switzerland. Although the war score might not be enough for that. With a loan offer from Bengal. 205 ducats for 4% interest. I'll take it. I don't have to pay it back. Just keep it. Caught. 105 ducats. Sure. Like, what are they gonna do? Attack me? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, it's evil. I know. I know. Okay, that doesn't look good. Ottoman separatists actually have, like, a castle over there, so... I will send I will send an army down to deal with this. That's some Milanese separatists. I don't I don't want them to break free. Milan has pretty good ideas though. But I think Florence is better at this point. And another country would like take another relationship slot. Oh man, that's another papal state army. Okay, let's let's maybe just try to make peace with them. Listen. This actually looks pretty good. I mean... 
okay that would be that would be pretty radical but I do want to stop the Pope from having all this land it just annoys me oh they would give that to me I'm not sure if I want either of those I mean I can just grant them to Florence later down the line I guess Gonna cause me to suffer a little bit of overextension. I don't want those provinces though. Hmm. So this is Liguria, this is Provence. Both of these are Provence, and then this is also Provence. How's France looking? And they have these as uh, strategic utility, but they don't really want them. They're not going to attack me for them, so I can live with that. Mm. What are your other interests? You have no interests over here. You have no interests in Italy whatsoever. Spain has, like, major interests in all of Italy, but that's not going to happen, buddy. I wonder if the islands are that important for us. Like if I don't go islands, I could take Navarra. Or maybe even Cuneo to have like another fort. That might be best. Something like this. That looks like a pretty crazy coalition, though. A crazy coalition at this point. But yeah, sure. This looks good. I'll take it. Florence is too large now to be a march. And Florentine Liberty Desire is very high. We have a bunch of prestige, though, so... And I guess we can pay off debt too. Uh, sure. Okay, the local rulers. We'll try to keep them all in check. I mean, I know. We're growing our vassals. Dunenburg is now in a military coalition. We should probably at least commit one diplomat towards outrage countries. I'll go for two diplomats for outrage countries, I guess. Okay, so this is back. Baden is in the military coalition now. Saxony. Reformation of the army. Do we want to get military tradition? No, we'll take the power. Barriers in a coalition, Trias in a coalition. This could actually get quite nasty, I gotta say. So, let's for once proclaim the Holy War to get that manpower recovery speed boost so that we look a little bit stronger. Yeah, Europe is pretty mad at this point. I get it. Whoa, Baman has actually dropped some troops down here. Really? That's surprising. Doesn't matter too much, but it is surprising. Florence is busy coring. I don't want Corsica. I want to give it away. And uh, I probably soon will. Can soon do that. Oh yeah, right. We have some ships here. Um, I wanted to go after Malta. So let's do that. 
bartering increases. Now oh, let's reduce the inflation then, I guess. Ugh, if it has to be. Send these troops down here so they can't follow us and destroy them. Okay, we got that. I think it might be time to build a fortress down here. We'll just build a bastion. That might be enough. Uh, we lost another general. Brandenburg is now in a military coalition. Come on, Brandenburg. Don't be like that. We're not there to do anything to you. We're just new to the Pope. Come on, chill. The Pope wanted it. Okay, so Lombok is now in our hands again. Very good. So now we can tr think about taking Spanish islands. Won the siege of Optimatoi. Let's go after this army. So we don't run into more troubles. Join the fleet. Oh, Ayutthaya already took that. Very nice. Well done, guys. Um, we won't be able to take this. Like Spain probably bought this from Bengal. They also bought this, which annoys me. Hmm. Oh, well, it's not really a way to do anything against that. I mean, at, le at least not until we are friends with Bengal again. What we could do, though, is take this. Palatinate is in a coalition. It's going to be a bumpy few years. Oh, Britain is over here. Really? Okay. Right. Oh man, that was a battle with a lot of losses. I want to keep our cardinal in Constantinople. I really wish this age would end. There's not much I can do. Election in the Serene Republic. All the candidates look pretty shitty. 325 is not too bad, though. Want to keep the traders in power. Yeah, and he's corrupt. It's just what we needed. Corrupt dude. Let's go ahead and take Malta for us. Now Spain proper is now completely, completely down. <laughs> what else could we do? We could go to Africa. Uh, like take a bunch of the African gold away. That could be something. Don't really think they have... Well, no, they actually have other colonies over here. Fiji. I don't necessarily want these islands, but... I'd rather I have them than that Spain has them. Gilbert Islands. Yeah, I guess I can't be asked to go for all these islands. I don't think I care too much. I don't want to hold them myself, so why bother? Why bother? This is full with rebels, Mutap and separatists. Bring our fleet back home. We'll see what we can do. Hey, Empezantium actually managed to take that one over. Very nice. Flip that to Florence, I'd say. The 
problem is that we're about to incur like a lot more aggressive expansion soonish. Oi! I guess we gotta. I guess we gotta force the crossing over here. Right now you can cross, guys. Come on, crossing is secured. You can totally do it now. Come on. France? No? Spain? Like Morocco and Spain? Don't you want to attack them? We well, can pick these Spanish fleets off bit by bit. That's pretty crazy. Why are they doing that? Okay, I'll, I'll leave my ships here to afford anyone who wants the chance at the crossing, the crossing. Because there are like a hundred thousand troops running around here. I want to do shit. Oh, damn it. No, we'll have to help. Um, I have to help our vassal over here. Won the siege of Ankara. All right, well. Did this. You on the boat. Ship you to Egypt. There is a problem with Bamanis down here in the night. Um, these are only level four forts, which is now coming back to bite us. I'm not sure if we can really win against the 40,000, 70,000 Bamani army. It's gonna be gnarly. Trade regulation, quartering of troops, inflation reduction, advisor costs, trade efficiency. We've got to go for this. Public tradition is fine, support populist is fine. <laughs> the army reformer dies. I have a 93% chance of passing this. I don't I don't care all that much. I think this is okay. Oh, the 50,000 Spanish peasants. Ooh, that doesn't look too good, Spain. Really doesn't look too good. Damn it. I'm sick of the Spanish fleet bullying my vassals. is a gnarly war but at least uh, these guys made it to the other side now they can't move further though until they've taken this I get that Oi! I should probably give this like a, a, a co command to hunt ships I think this should be the end of this fleet eh, we managed to get a trade ship now, just another transport ship. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of these. Well, we can sell them later down the line if we wanted to. That's something that we could do. These guys need to repair. At least we forced a crossing. If we take all of this too... Um, times are going to be really bad for Spain. Yes, they have a lot of occupation here, but... I could probably even, like, demand from them that they give me some... That they give me these lands in, uh... In India. Although they have a lot of Maratha separatists in here. It would be kind of funny if this broke away from Spain. I would like that. These guys are fighting Bhutan now. I wouldn't mind if that was all in one hand, so I could take it over easier. Nothing to say against that. So East Timor would probably be a 
the best place to build like another fortress to like protect this area. Zumba doesn't really have access at all. I'll I'll add that to the to the trade company. I'll add that to the trade company. This can be added to the trade company. This can be added. Like the fact that these guys are papuan doesn't really matter all that much. This is still not done though, so that's a little bit of a problem. Is this still a trade area? Yeah, this is still more lock and charter. Hmm. Philippine charter might be another thing. Well, we should try to like go for this place and then conquer what we don't have. Oh yeah, we have military tech. It's like 5%. I think we should take it if we can. Military tactics and infantry shock. That's actually quite a bit. I bet you the papal state actually had that. Yeah, that's 21. That's not good. Having military tactics, uh, military tactics deficit is a real pain in the bum. It's a real problem. Flip that to Naples. Oh yeah, I actually have to end the episode. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you join me next time. We'll probably bring the war against Spain to an end. Hopefully we can dissolve that coalition first. Doesn't really look all too great, but yeah, we'll see how, we'll see how it goes. Brandenburg is almost there, I'd say. Like they, they don't really have an interest in fighting against me, I don't think. But yeah, we'll see how things go. Hope you join me next time. Bye-bye.